Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Phil the Mile High Mouth, and today we're going to talk a bit about this game that I'm no good at, but I'm kind of a little obsessed with. Sort of. Um, this is Baltaro. Or Bellatro? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I'm really bad about that. Ah. Oh, cool. I can do this. Bilatro. Anywho. What's kind of funny. Let's see. High contrast cars, graphics, etc. Let's move the music up a little bit. There we go. Yeah. So, um... You can set up a thing here too, where you can play it normally, or you can have it unlock everything, and then you just like the challenges are there to beat. Um, yeah, I was playing through it normally, and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna. There's apparently there's an option to lo unlock all the cards. Okay, I'll do that. So I did, but it doesn't make the game any easier, and it doesn't make it any less fun. It just adds more stuff for you to do, or more stuff you can choose from. Anyways, um, <laughs> there's um, the basic idea of it is you're kind of playing poker. I'm going to play through the small blind, the big blind, and I guess we'll take out that the pillar. Actually, I'm looking at that, I'm like, yeah, I don't really, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this, skip the blind, because you can do that initially. I'll skip this, it'll give me about 14 bucks, and then we're just going to take on the pillar. We want to hit 600, and the way to do this, yeah, there's not is um by making poker hands, right? On this run info, we're here. Here are the things that you can do, right? Straight flush, four of a kind, etc. Those are the poker hands. No vouchers have been done, nothing. But yeah, let's take a look at this. Okay, you have a certain number of hands that you can play, and a certain number of discards. Hmm, let's sort this by sweet. We don't have enough to make a flush, of course. And I'm looking at this, I'm like, hmm. We don't have anything here but two pair. But So you know what I'm going to do? I am going to play it unsafe and discard a whole bunch. Now that's actually pretty better. But I have a feeling I can do better than that. There, well, let's see, we have a king, we have an ace, a king, a queen, jack, and ten. That's a straight right there. See, we could do that, and that would give us um, 120, but we need at least 600, right? So I'm going to put those down a bit, and I'm going to, I'm going to gamble those out. Oh my gosh, I should have taken the rest of those out. There we go. We're gonna do this because we're out of um, things, and that's gonna be uh, what? F Forty-two, like four hundred and twenty. Yeah, let's play that hand, and then it's gonna add them. It's gonna add ten plus for each of those, and we beat it. We get the seven hundred. So we took out that first blind. And that's how you play this game. But here's how you play around with it a lot. You see those things I skipped earlier? Um, well, when you finish up a round, you get cash out. And then you're given stuff. Like, for example, you can do this. You can re-roll the boss blind. They beat up that boss blind. And then there's things you can do like our, our tar tarot cards, um, planet cards, and jokers. Now, this joker will give me plus 10 to the multiplier if the can contains two pair. It's a common holographic, we're gonna buy it. That's the one that we got free. We have about 24, so we can buy a bunch of this stuff and I can show you what they do. Now, this one here levels up two pair, plus multi and plus 20 chips, right? Let's go ahead and use this. And now, whenever we get two pair, it'll be leveled up. Let's take a look at the run info, see this? Since we've leveled up this one, you can see each of these different card hands. Since we leveled up this one, 
it'll give us a little bit more okay now let's see here let's let's see what other types of jokers we have add double the rank of lowest rank card hand into multi, held in hand to multi the hand is the thing of, thing of um, cards you have earlier. This one's plus three chips for every re remaining discard. Um, I don't want any of those. I'm going to skip them. Yeah, you can. sometimes you can waste money. <laughs> but we have enough for a re-roll, so I don't care. And now these ones allow you to do some crazy cool stuff. You can change cards into other things. And you can convert what they are. So let's take a look at our deck, right? This is our standard deck. You can mess around with this quite a bit. And um, let's see. For example, gold cards. Um, if you have them in your hand at the end of the round, you get an additional $3 for each of them. Then lucky cards have a chance of either giving you multiplayer stuff or more points. And then this converts all those three to spades. For example, these are spades, these are touch hips, etc. And clubs, you got clubs, diamonds, and hearts, right? you can literally change out your cards so that like you can have more of one or the other or so and the reason for that the reason you would want to do that is because it makes it easier to get a straight flush or a flush where everything is the same um suit or let's say you're coming up on a boss and that boss has an ability that um blocks you from using spades or blocks you from losing clubs or, or hearts or whatever you can change stuff into this into a like a different thing with these um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna change the yeah this one is a one in five chance for plus 20 multi or one in 15 to win just 20 bucks automatically you know what we're gonna we're gonna use we're gonna use this one and what we're gonna use it on is we're gonna use it on this king that's a silly thing to do but whatever oh by the way um, we can get extra cards. Hmm. No, we're going to re-roll. And let's see what we have here. We have... This one's just plus four to the multi. We'll just add it in there. And then this one we're going to use in, use in buy. Planet cards are always a good idea. In fact, there's some stuff where you can get those for free. Let's start the next round. Let's see. If we skip this one, we'd have a negative joker. If we skip this one, it'll re-roll what this is. Um, if we use this one, like this boss here has a base chips and multi are halved, right? That one messes with those multipliers that we had here. It messes with those. So we're gonna play through these to see if we can roll up some stuff to defend ourselves against that. Okay, so we could go for like, if we had a seven, we'd have a small, we'd have a straight, right? And if I had changed some of those to spades earlier, or if I'd gotten that spade arcana and kept it, I could have changed these into spades and gotten a flush. But let's see, two pair plus four multi. Let's actually, we'll keep that 10. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna discard the entirety of that. I am, I actually have not beaten one of these yet, but I don't, oh, look at this, look at this, we got a full house. So that's a 40 by four, right? But when we add this, it's gonna do 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 by four. And then because there's two, there's two pair in there, because of this, it'll do another plus 10 for the multi and then plus four for multi. So we might just, we might be able to beat the small blind in one hand. We'll check. Uh, my math up the top of my head isn't the best, but whatever. Nope, okay, when you see the flames, that means you beat it. Boom. And that is super satisfying to do. I don't know how, I think, um, oh, by the way, the little thing on the bottom where it says anti, like the amount that the blinds cost goes up but I think you have to hit like a certain thing. Like once you get to like anti or anti eight or whatever, there's like a th there's a there's a final boss. Ah, uh, I, I, it shows up and I ha and um I haven't actually beaten it. I get to it and it beats me because it has like forty thousand for the score or something. It's kind of a little ridiculous. Oh, 
now I get money for each of the remaining hands, right? So I had three hands remaining. There is also a joker that gives you stuff remaining for like the the three for your discards. And then there's other types of jokers that are let's just cash those out. Okay? Let's see. I don't want that. Hmm, four dollars. Earn four dollars if a poker hand is a pair. Poker hand changes at the end of the round. Hmm, celestial pack and buffoon pack, etc. By the way, let's check something on here. Like, let's check the collection. Now, there's other types of stuff too, right? Now, there's your jokers, and there's 150 of those. Decks, there's our, um, there's these. These are the different types that you can start with. I'm just gonna, whoop, whoop. And vouchers, these are, those are the things that you can buy. And I'm not gonna show you what they look like. Buy the game. <laughs> Tarot cards, those are the ones that you can mess with. And then spectral cards are interesting. Like this one. Convert it gives you like a little hand of cards and it goes, converts all cards in hand to a single random suite. Mm-hmm. Or this one to all same rank. I did this once uh, where I got the Ouija one and uh, the Ouija one and uh it changed like nine of my cards to kings, and it was like Oh, that's beautiful. Some of these are pretty good. Then also you can destroy cards, by the way. Um, it, depending on how you're doing a deck. Upgrade every poker hand by one level, etc. Polychrome stuff. Those are things that they have. You can also get tags. Level your money, etc. Rerolls in the next shop, that type of thing. So many different types. And then there's there's five different types plus one joker slot times point five times 1.5 multi plus 10 multi plus 50 chips and no extra extra effects there's seals which are like they create new cards um and then enhanced cards there's six different type a lucky card gold card which i showed you steel card oh sorry glass cards those break they can break multi they add more to that and then one of my favorites are these right it's just plus 50 chips. A fun one is to get two pair and then a stone card. Let's go back. Let's go back to our run. Hmm, what do we want to buy? Hmm, I only have four bucks. I have nine bucks and I don't want to spend too much. I don't want to reroll either. I'll check the, check the jokers. What do we get? Each face card held in hand has a one in two chance to give a dollar. You know what? I'm gonna pick this one because no, I don't always end up at the final ran round, and I'm just gonna—I'm not gonna skip this one. I'm just gonna go. Let's do it. <clears throat> okay. So we got one, two pair, two pair, two pair, then faces. Let's get rid of these ones. Okay, that's a bit better. You know what? We're gonna do this. Okay. So. Remember the one that we had there? Like each face card held in hand has a one in two chance to give a dollar. Oh, wait. That's held in hand, not playing. Let's start with this. Multi and those. So we got two pair. So plus ten, plus four. Let's play this hand. And we'll see if we win some money. We did. And we also won this round. Boom. That was a good choice. Well, I mean, we might sell that Joker. Which, by the way, you can sell the Jokers. Let's cash that out. Ooh. Let's see. Plus 15 multi when discards are. So discards remain. Play card with Diamond Suite. Give plus 3 multi when scored. Um, I'm gonna sell that. Let's see. I like those are fine. This one's good. You know, there's a boss that takes away all your discards. <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, whatever. Hmm, planet tarot cards. Oh, let's use these. I like these. What do we get? What do we get? Hmm. Okay, this one will create a random Joker card. Gives you the total cell value, so which is currently like six. This one 
sometimes usually just says nope <laughs> and doesn't give me anything but I like this one right here right it converts select two cards and convert the left card into the right card okay oh man we can be evil with this if we want you know what Okay, boop, boop, let's put it to the right. Boop, boop, and then we're going to use it. It's going to change, oh wait, yeah, it's going to change the left card, which we have here, this one, into that. So you just kind of mess with the deck. Ha 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 ha, more aces. Hmm. Planet cards. Now that we've got more aces, we have more of a chance of getting like three of a kind or whatnot, so... Oh, I don't have enough money to buy that. You know what? We're just going to do this next round. We have to hit 1600. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oh. There's a straight. I'm just going to play it. It's not going to beat it, but you know, whatever. I don't mind. I just wanted to move those out. Okay, you know what? Discard. Hmm, let's discard that. And let's discard that. Ah, you're discarding too much. Oh no, now I have zero discards. Whatever am I going to do? Wait. Do that full house. Uh huh. <laughs> it's all math. It's math magical. Remaining hands to one interest. Oh yeah, there's a thing too. If you have, in some versions and some decks. Every five dollars that you have gets you interest each time you finish a round. Ooh. Raise the cap on interest earned to each of each round to ten bucks. Not bad. This gives you Let's buy that. And let's buy that one. We're not gonna mess with the other stuff yet. Let's see we got uh for each discarded thing that changes every round. Gains plus four chips. That that's a weird one to use. These ones are fun. Hmm. Plus eighty chips. That's a good card. But I'm gonna do this one. Oh wait, I can do two. I'm gonna do that one too. Yeah. Okay, gains plus three. And, ooh, let's add some cards to our deck, but we can't. Um, because we use the stuff. We're holding on to that deck, though. Let's see. Rerolls and next shop. Ooh, all cards are drawn face down. I hate that one. Like, the mark? I don't like that one. But there's ways around it, and I'll show you how, show you what they are when I get to it. Hmm, what to do? I'm gonna discard you. King? Oh, come on. I want a king. Give me a king. Eh. Okay, so. Let's see. What do we want to do? Do we want to do two pair for three? Or do we want to do a high straight? Hmm. What to do? Or do we want to be really wild and be like, watch, watch. We could be pretty wild here. I'm thinking, whoop. That four is all like, no, don't do this to me. Yes, do that to you. Ha, 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 ha. Whoop. 
and that's permanent too, by the way. Well, not permanent. I mean, once it's permanent for this round. Hmm. What do we do? We have one more discard left. You know what? I'm gonna risk it with that discard and be all like, discard. Now we have plus, we have plus, plus 15. Hmm. We won't be able to take advantage of that, the even ones. And you know what? Forget that. I don't want any of these. I want to. I want to re-roll those and discard them. But I don't have anything to discard them, so I don't discard. So I'm just gonna throw them in here as like some extra junk. It's not gonna tally it into there. Although there is a card that you can get, a Joker, that lets it tally everything you play. And that one has saved my life a couple times. Anywho. Okay. Three remaining hands. One on interest. Yay, we've cashed out all that. That one's good, right here. You all like I've kept I've had that on my hand before where I've just used it to make so much stuff gold. Plus, discard each round. That's a good one. Standard, you can add stuff to your deck. Planet cards are good. But you know what? We're going to play this one. What to add? Hmm, that retrigger. Oh, retriggering means that this particular card, it'll um, play it and give you two points. And then it'll play it again to give you plus two, plus two, more, two more chips. But we're going to pick, like, if we have this in our hand, it gives times 1.5 multi, multi, while it's still in your hand, so if you're not playing it. But we're going to grab the queen. And... Well, I love my discards, and I'm going to need the discards for the boss on this. Okay, let's do the next round. Okay. We need something to defend ourselves against that upcoming one, sort of. Okay, one, two, buckle my shoe. Okay, so we got ace, king, queen, and jack, seven, sevens, bum, bum, discard us. Mm, bum, bum, bum. Remember, a flush is everything, like for example, oh, I have a flush right here, watch. That's a royal flush. <laughs> this is an instant win. Let's do it. Wow! I wonder how much we'll get. Look at that. With our stuff, plus, plus, plus. Yes! We should have discarded more to get like the extra one. We could have done so much more to that. You saw what I did wrong, right? Yeah. Mm. You have to be kind of a little ruthless with these, but it's okay. Hmm. I like that one, but then I would lose all that. Hmm. This one's a fun one because the ace, the plus 31 on the ace is better than like a lot of other things. I like the discard. Um, let's just... I'm gonna sell that. I'm gonna go to this one and we're gonna grab a tarot card. Fun thing about these, oh, what do we have? Hmm, give a total sell, 10. I could turn some stuff into a multi. Oh, let's just use this. There we go. 19. And we're gonna buy that voucher. Yay! Seed money redeemed. Cause the voucher resets after each after you defeat a boss blind. And then let's do we'll do this. It leaves us with five. So if or when we beat the blind, we'll be able to uh, hmm, planet card. Let's do this one. I prefer the money. Let's do the next. Okay, so all face cards are drawn face down. Oh, this one's funny. There's one that does all cards drawn face down, but hehe. <laughs> so, 
we don't know what this is, but we know it's a face card. And the face card is a king, queen, or jack. Ten, nine, five. You know what we can do? Let's uh, let's discard all of these. Okay, so there's our ace. These are either a king, queen, or jack, or whatever. Right? Now let's go to sort hand and do suite. Now we have a little bit of an idea of what they could be. We know that whatever this is, it's probably, it's either blue or red. This one is definitely something with a diamond. And this one is definitely something with a spade. So we, we're kind of moving these around a bit. I feel like this is a jack. Let's, let's just play these and see what we get. We're not going to get a straight, but we might get something. If we got a straight, that would be funny. Let's do it. Nope, at least we got two pair. That's why that's kind of annoying. I mean, but I have cards to protect me. Ooh. Let's, um, let's discard these. Because we have so many discards that we should use them so that we get down to zero. Yeah. Ah. Uh, discard. No. Okay. So one, two, three. And this could be either king, queen, or jack. But if it's two of them, we haven't like if we do this we either have a three of a three or we have a full house. So let's gamble on it a little bit. Okay, we got a three. Three of a kind, not the best. But we have that multi for the odds, so not bad. And we still won. Boom! We had two hands left. Yeah, so we got five from beating that. We'll get two for that and then <sighs> ten for that to make us to wait five you know, one interest per five to so ten packs. Oh. Okay. Hmm. This'll make more stuff appear that's like good. This retickers first played card scored using scoring two additional times. That's kind of funny. That one earns you four at the end of the round. You know what? Uh, hmm. I'm going to sell that one. And we're going to play with this one for a little bit. And let's see what we have here. You know what? I want to see more of these types of cards. So I'm just going to do this. Yep, redeemed. Okay, so we have, um, ooh, the plant. All face cards are debuffed. Not a problem. We're going to skip these blinds, right? We're going to get a Mega Celestial pack. Yay! And I think what we want to do is use... We have high card leveled up, but let's level up full house. And let's pick up. Four of a kind. We're going to be messing around with those little, little face cards anyways. Now this one, if we beat this, the 10,000 will gain 25 bucks. Okay, so we're going to hit the plant. Okay, see what we had here? So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to be a little bit uh, creative. Okay, because like face cards, aces don't count as face cards, which is kind of great and a little broken. But okay. And let's see. Yeah, that's going to give me... That ace is going to give me 33. Because <laughs> we're using this. Bunk. 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 Oh, yeah, and we have that ace that gives us 31 on those, so... <laughs> that's us defending ourselves against that stupid thing's blind. 
Oh yeah. And now, let's get rid of these ones. Because, like, we have a chance of getting another nine. Yeah. And let's get rid of these sevens. I don't care about the sevens. Oof. Well, we didn't get what we wanted, but I also don't care. Check it. And we'll just get rid of this, this seven that's there. You know what we could do? That's a flush. Okay, do we want to do two pair or a flush? 40 by 3, 35 by 4. We're going to do 35 by 4. Yeah. And then, like, the other stuff is in there because we have this right here, which has that 7 and the aces. It's going to give me 31 on those. Okay. Boom. Again. <laughs> Just look at that, just racking it up. I like this game, it's good. See it? All good. Score at least 10,000. Do the cash out for 32. And now we have a bunch. Raise the interest, the cap on the interest yeah, to uh, 20. And each round to 20. <laughs> Neat. Okay, so in four, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Let's use this, see if it gives us nope. It does, nope. Oh. Hmm. Sorry. Ugh. But yeah, let's check on that. Let's see, next round, reroll. On a four. Mm, let's use some planet cards. Mm, what to do? Level up a pair, three of the kind. Let's level up our three of a kind. I feel like we could get more from that. Definitely could. Mm hmm. Hmm, let's reroll. When the round begins, add a random playing card with a random seal to your hand. Destroys up to two selected cards. Huh. You know? Not sure. Actually, I'm gonna buy that. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for. But we'll see. Next base is that. Mm, don't care. Let's do a slick, a small blind. Okay. Hmm. Let's discard those. You know what? I think I know what I'm gonna do that for. Um, generally, you want to use. Yeah, I'm gonna discard these and wait, what am I doing? I should do this. That's funny. Actually, that means we have one more ace up our sleeve. Let's discard, see if we get it. We have a king, jack, queen, and jack. And this three. We're going to destroy this three. Boom, now I have less threes. Why do I want less threes? Hmm. I really want less twos. I ultimately want to remove the lower cards from existing completely. Note that we've almost made fours ex Well, like we want to remove those from existing. Oh, well, let's see what we get with this. And then... Give me my 900. <laughs> oh my goodness, yes. That's funny. <laughs> that 
that one with the discards like is pretty powerful. Yes. Hmm. That might appear multiple times. Hmm, good stuff. We could raise the cap. Hmm. We're gonna add a card. We broke a card. Let's add a card. Ooh, I wanna add that one. Um, yeah. More aces. And because there's a chance that we'll get like three of a kind. Oh, wait, why did I do that? That was dumb. Anywho, let's fight this one. Ooh, okay. Let's do next round. Uh, huh. We aren't gonna hold on to that, but we are gonna get rid of these three. Those three. Let's play that and get our three. Yay! I, I don't care. <laughs> um, like, I might... I don't know if I'll win on this one. I mean, I'm trying to do what I can. Do what I can. So we have to make 10,000 more. Ooh. Let's discard some more. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh well. Time to win. And we have that king in there, so we're gonna get three dollars from that. And a little bit extra mana. This is a great game and people should play it. I'm gonna go until either I win or lose. I've played, what, 10 rounds? Actually, yeah, let me check my current stats. Best hand, progress, blah, blah, blah. Actually, let me check my run info. You know what it doesn't tell me? It doesn't tell me the, uh, the seed for this because there are seeded runs hmm hmm let's do that let's do the cap on the money tree thank you money tree and we're gonna we're gonna buy this just in case we need it Okay, discard two random hands per two. Okay, this one's annoying, but not unbeatable. So it's not too bad. And the thing is, it's for hands played. So you can build out to what you need well before you have to worry about it discarding stuff on you. Boop, boop. You know what we could do? Let's see, these turn things into spades, right? Hmm. One, two. Eh. We could do a straight. And that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a straight. We're gonna play the straight. It's going to discard at least one or two of those things that I have there. Huh, should we do a straight or a three? Hmm. A kind of... Or we could do a full house. So a straight... Oh! Dang it, I did not mean to do that. Whoops. I'm sitting there and I hit the wrong button. I meant to hit B and I hit Y. Ah oh well, we'll see if we survive. We could still, we could still survive. We still have these joker, these things. 
Oh, actually. Oh, I don't have discards for those. Oh, no. Wait. Wait, I know what. And then... Let's do one of these. But here's what we're going to do. Okay, let's do... Move that spade down. Move that spade down. We're going to turn these ones into spades. Okay, good on you. Bloop, 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 flush, but also two pair. That one's going to turn that into a third. Mm-hmm. We have two hands left. And it's a little bit worrisome. We have this three. And then... You know what? We're gonna... We're gonna play the three. And hope that it pulls out the numbers. Oh, it did! <laughs> so, we're just gonna cut it a little close. We are definitely cutting it a little close. Or we might, we might still win. Oh, we are cutting it close. Oof. And I do not have a reason for those. So we're doing this two pair. And we have, we have, we're just going to throw that on there. It's not going to count it, but you know, whatever. Okay, so. Dunk, dunk. Are we going to win? We might. We, we could cut it close. We could barely win. Or we could barely lose. What's your math say? What does the scouter math say? The math says we won. <laughs> okay. Wait. Hmm. Let's see. Two tarot cards at the end of one round, round payout increases by two when boss blind is defeated, but rerolls cost two dollars less. Mm. I actually kind of dig what I have, um, although I could probably kill that one off and. Let's let's buy one of these. Boop 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 boop. Uh. What do we want? Hmm. Let's select that for money. Okay. This gets us, adds another voucher, plus three hand size. Cards drawn face down after each hand played. Ooh, the fish. You know what? Skip. Let's do this. Let's take on the fish. I don't think this is like... We're going to try and take it down, see if we can take it down on one hand. Can we, though? Bloop, 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 bloop. I don't know. Wait. We have a bunch of those. Let's, uh, let's discard stuff. Let's, because I want the plus 14. <laughs> okay. We didn't get a chance to discard any queens yet, but I think we're going to be okay. Like, oof. Okay. 
this looks tricky. You know what? Let's peek the deck. What do we have a chance of getting? We don't know what those are. Hmm, let's, let's see if we can divide them by suite. Bloop. Okay. Now let's divide by rank. I don't know if it's telling me the truth, though. Let's do it. This is tricky. I don't think we're gonna win. Let's um, do by sweet. We don't know what those are, so we're just going to play them. We hoped. We're going to lose to the fish. You know, there's stuff that can take out the blind, but oh gosh. Let's play it. Yuck. We lost. No! And that's what a game over looks like. By the way, the seed that I did, yeah, it looks like the joke's on us. You can see here at the bottom, the, the seed for this one that I just played is PMVLKQDD. This game is a little bit like uh, Vampire Survivors or The Binding of Isaac, where you can kind of play it forever. But yeah, let me know in the comments below if you've played this game or if this increased your interest in this game. And until the next video comes out, you are now caught up. Morning, Maya.